Among patients with type 2 diabetes, the glucagon-like peptide 1 receptor agonist semaglutide has been shown to improve glycemic control, lead to weight loss, and reduce cardiovascular events. But less is known about its effects on kidney outcomes in patients who also have chronic kidney disease, or CKD. A new trial assessed semaglutide's effects on major kidney outcomes in this population. In this randomized controlled double-blind trial, 3,533 adults with type 2 diabetes and CKD were randomly assigned to receive weekly subcutaneous semaglutide or placebo. The primary outcome was major kidney disease events, a composite of kidney failure onset, a 50% or greater reduction in EGFR from baseline, or death from kidney-related or cardiovascular causes. At a median follow-up of 3.4 years, the semaglutide group experienced 5.8 major kidney disease events per 100 patient years of follow-up, as compared with 7.5 events per 100 patient years in the placebo group, which was equivalent to a 24% risk reduction. The decline in kidney function, a secondary outcome, was slower in the semaglutide group than in the placebo group. Serious adverse events were less common among recipients of semaglutide. The authors conclude that among patients with type 2 diabetes and high-risk chronic kidney disease, semaglutide reduced the risk of major kidney disease events. Full trial results are available at NEJM.org.